Hey, it's Barbara from Retrofit Pilates. I'm here with Christina, and we're gonna take a closer look at the neck pull today. Neck pull's a bit of a misnomer in that you're not really pulling your neck. It's kind of like a roll up where your hands are behind the back of your head, and you really realize how much your arms play a difference in doing your roll ups. So we're gonna show a couple variations today because it's quite challenging for a lot of folks, and so Christina's gonna show those couple of options. Let's get started. Christina's gonna start sitting up tall with her hands behind the back of her head, her legs are about hip bone distance apart with her ankles flexed. Christina's gonna take a lovely inhale and then exhale to round her body forward over her thigh. Christina's rounding forward as much as she can, really keeping the stomach in. We've got a little pillow behind Christina's back and we'll show you why. From here, Christina will flatten her spine, hinging forward, good, keeping that chest and collarbone wide. From here, tighten the stomach, sit up tall, stay neutral spine or slightly extended and hinge back. With that flat back. When you can't go any further, scoop into the belly, slowly roll down. Good, when you get down, take your arms to the ceiling. Christina, good, and then reach the arms forward, nod the chin and start to roll back up. This is a nice way to come into the neck pull if you uh, want to work your way up to it. Round forward, place your hands behind the back of your head. Good, once again, extend your spine, flattening your back, hinge the chest forward, good. Sit up nice and tall and then continue hinging back, flat back. When you can't go further, scoop into the belly and roll back down. Good, from here, Christina, we're gonna try it with the hands behind the back of your head. I'm gonna hold on to Christina's legs to give her a little bit of assistance. Take a big inhale. On your exhale, nod your chin. This is where you can get a little sticky. Round forward, up and over your legs. Extend your spine forward, flattening the spine. Sit up nice and tall. And one more time, scoop into the belly, roll back down, using that pillow to manage the curve of Christina's spine. From here, here we go. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, I've got your legs. Scoop into the belly and roll back up. And that is the neck pull. So as you can see, kind of challenging to get up with the hands behind the back of your head. So a few different ways to work into it. Enjoy.